This is probably one of the best of, of the weekend. Uh, Luca and Booker. I cannot wait for Eddie's take on this when we return. <laughs> Oh, Phoenix and Dallas. This is a this is a rivalry. Phoenix and Dallas. Suns do get the win here. KD with the go-ahead bucket. Luca then has a shot. Misses the easy one. He and Devin Booker. They exchange words. Like this is I mean, he should have had this, right? That's that's very rare that he would miss something like that. But it's the words after and it's the the trash talking. Afterwards, Luca had uh had this to say it's a competitive game. It's all good. Next time, <laughs> just don't wait until three seconds left to talk. I mean, if you didn't know any better, you think they were best friends and they were just about to hang out. But that's not at all what was happening there, Chandler. I love this beef, and I hope that we get to see them in the playoffs. But who are you taking in this beef battle between Luca and Devin Booker? <laughs> there, there's, there's no, there's no beef here. And if you really what? watch the video, there's no beef here. And if you watch the video, <laughs> Devin is actually he's talking to the referee. He's talking to the ref. That's what he and, said. And listen, this is great. First of all, I love it. This is great for the league. This is great for the fans. <laughs> These are two absolute stars, both on really good teams. And they go at it. And, and now the series is tied two and two. I can only hope for this to be a playoff series. But look, I think this is fantastic. And then at least we're not sitting here today talking about the Mavs final possession, whether it was a horrible yeah. look or what was a turnover. They did the right thing. Luca got to the basket. He's making those nine times out of ten, and they had a chance there. But listen, this is this is now they're, they're three and six with Kyrie Irving, and the Suns are three and zero oh with Kevin Durant. And 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 it's it's an interesting setup because both these teams are very good, and I think the Mavs are going to come around. They're they're they're, they're going to find it. This beef. Why is, this why is beef, Eddie laughing? Why is that? I, right I don't. I don't think there's a real like beef here i just think it's a competitive spirit but listen I, I, yeah we but there's beef. not like there's hatred it's not like they were gonna fight they literally i thought they were gonna make out they're not gonna throw punches i mean i'm in on that too <laughs> whatever they want to do I'm, I'm here for it like it's, yeah. it's totally fine eddie why are you laughing because when i can't see your face but only hear you i think you're up to something I had not seen the Jason Kidd Monty Williams video. That was perfect. That was amazing. I, I, I would tell her I love this. I love this for the league. That's what Devin Booker said. You, do, you guys don't want us to be all friends, and now when, when this happens, it's a big deal. Uh, I, I don't think it. it's beef either. I think it's basketball. Like, if me and Shams play enough basketball games, this something like this might end up happening if, if we're <laughs> competitive enough. Uh, I, I love that nobody's wrong. Everybody was trying to figure out who was wrong in this situation. Book is right for being an irritant and, and kind of <laughs> – Joking with the ref that that's a foul. Luca's right for going, hey, yo, shut up. And, and then they're all right for being upset, getting each other's face. Kyrie was, was talking. Yeah. Kevin yeah, was talking. Was. This is great. This wasn't one of the best games of the season. It wasn't marred by this. Like, this isn't the story. This is one of the best games of the season. Uh, all three of those guys had almost 40 points. Like, this was incredible to watch. Uh, it shows what the what the Mavericks can be, even though they ended up losing in the end. It shows what the what the Suns are capable of. And don't let it be lost on you. Late in that game, the Suns went to their bread and butter, and their bread and butter was not Kevin Durant or, or Devin Booker. It was Chris Paul and DeAndre Ayton pick and roll. And DeAndre Ayton had a huge putback late in that game to tie it up. This is an incredible game, one of the best games of the season. I love this. The added tension is even better. I hope we get a series. I hope we get series for years to come. Oh, yeah. uh, the Suns owe them one. And there's clearly, you know, there's that competitiveness. They have that history. They've played so much in the last year. How could you not hate him a little bit? But beef? Nah, just basketball. Why, it's just why basketball. can't we just call it beef? That's what we want. We love beef. Yeah. This is not beef. This is not, I, I listen to yeah. Biggie Smalls. This is not beef. Oh, <laughs> Levels do it. Shams, I know, I know you want to get in here. Yeah, uh, you know what? What I'm what I'm curious about is just the development of some of these guys at the back end of the bench. Like Ish Wainwright comes into the game. He had three really big threes in the second half of the game when the game was kind of slipping away. Dallas started to get a lead, and Ish Wainwright came in, made a few big threes. And I think when you look at the job James Jones James Jones has done since he's taken over as Suns GM full time in 2019, hires Monty Williams. They draft Cam Johnson. They go eight zero in the bubble. Uh, Monty Williams, Devin Booker come out of the scene, win awards in the bubble. Then he goes and acquires Chris Paul. They made to the 2021 NBA Finals. He wins executive of the year, franchise best 64 wins. Now they get Kevin Durant. And you look at the development of guys like Ish Wainwright, 
uh, Cam Payne, Cam Johnson, Mikhail Bridges, two guys that are now doing well in Brooklyn. You have to give credit kind of the pipeline of, of the basketball culture and development that's already been there that's made it a destination for a guy like Kevin Durant to want to go play there. And now he's there, and I feel like you add him to what they've already built. What James Jones has built with, with DeAndre Ayton and Chris Paul and, and, and Devin Booker. This is a, a super dangerous team. And you look at Kevin Durant, the job he does with Devin Booker, he's really their missing piece. Like, this is the guy that we've been waiting for the last two years. Uh, they had a chance to win the 2021 NBA Finals. They were, this year, and even last year, we felt like they were missing one more guy. They needed to make a move, uh, and they go out and make it.